If you're looking to boost your testosterone levels naturally and you're trying to find exactly what type of foods to consume that will improve your metabolism, energy, while boosting your natural testosterone, this is the video that I'm going to be talking about this subject. Hey, what's up? Alex here from Natural Testosterone, where I help you set up a simple plan with realistic approaches to have a life-changing experience by optimizing natural testosterone. So in today's video, I'm talking, gonna be talking about the foods to boost testosterone levels. So specifically, I'm gonna be talking about only the foods to eat, not the foods to avoid. I will cover that in a different video. So as you know, by the food industry by how it's poorly regulated a lot of foods out there we just shouldn't consume if it comes to natural testosterone because they they have anti-nutrients pesticides and chemicals and phytoestrogens which lower testosterone levels so in today's video i'm just going to be talking about the carbohydrates fats and proteins you should be consuming to improve natural testosterone have more energy help with muscle growth fat loss and things like that but at the end of the day to make like progress if it comes to building muscle or losing fat you need the right calorie intake for your goals and macronutrients so let's start with carbohydrates so as you know carbohydrates have four calories per one gram so let's say the carbohydrates that i personally recommend to my clients and the foods that i include in the custom meal plans that i make for them is fruits like pomegranates kiwis bananas any type of fruit make sure it's organic you can consume fruit juices as well if it's good quality you can consume dried fruit like raisins prunes and things like that and then organic fruit juices will come with that as well but make sure it's organic because the non-organic fruit juices have like added refined sugars and things like that the other carbohydrates that i recommend is roots for example potatoes carrots like there's like full of nutrients just think about it when you leave a carrot or a potato out and don't use it for a couple of weeks it will actually start growing on its own that's how much nutrient dense it is that it can actually grow on its own so imagine what happens when you actually consume it because it's dense in the nutrient for fats so i personally re recommend saturated and monounsaturated fats the reasoning behind that is because they have strong bonds mono meaning two and saturated are just one bond and our body heat won't oxidize these fats when we consume them when you're in a low metabolic state i would only stick to the saturated fats part, like only and then when you have like slowly increasing your metabolism and your testosterone then i would start incorporating more monounsaturated fats such as olive oil avocados things like that but then for saturated you have like organic grass-fed butter organic minced beef coconut oil and that's the ones i would look for i wouldn't consume nuts because nuts are high in polyunsaturated fats and polyunsaturated fats are no good for testosterone because they oxidize and cause oxidative stress in the body so then for the last micronutrients which is proteins so if it comes to protein i always 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 recommend you consume organic types of protein because in my opinion and studies have shown this conventional meat versus like organic meat two different type of things so focusing on the organic grass fed minced beef uh, pork chicken whatever eggs organic milk if you're in a high metabolic state and focusing on organic meats only yes it it's more costly but it's worth it at the end if you're having difficult time finding organic meats at your shop look for the like 
the meats that have the least amount of fat because fats is what actually holds the bad stuff in it so for example organ like if you can only get minced beef get the one that's like 99 percent lean or whatever the leanest you can get so this video i kept it nice and short but hopefully it helped i'm going to link some studies down below just to prove to you that these foods do improve natural testosterone production so thank you for watching and see you next vid peace